Good morning, this is Andy with Condi Systems, and today I'd like to show you how to use the head maintenance scheduler on the power driver for the Virtuoso SG800. We're going to right click on our power driver. Now you'll notice this said SG400, but that's because I have multiple printers on the same port. I'm going to come down to Printing Preferences and then come over to the Power Driver SG800. If this is the only power driver you have installed, you won't see the arrows. You just go to Printing Preferences and click, and it'll bring this up. Once we're here on the Virtual Printer Driver tab, I'm going to click on Utilities, and then I'm going to open the Head Maintenance Scheduler. When we click on this, it's going to open the scheduler. You'll notice I can schedule either nozzle checks or head cleanings. Now at Condi, we recommend that you do a nozzle check at least once a week. So you just want to go through and pick the days at which you want to do your maintenance. We're going to set an effective start date, and I'm just going to use today as the start date. And then I'm going to set this at a time that's convenient. For this instance, I'm actually going to set this at 4 a.m. Uh, once I have this all scheduled, and again I can schedule a nozzle check or a head cleaning, but I'm just going to do the nozzle check. I'm going to set this schedule and I'm going to click OK. We'll get a message saying that you've successfully scheduled the task. Now by doing this Monday morning at 4 a.m., when I come into work on Monday, my nozzle check pattern should be sitting waiting for me on the printer. Key notes about this, the printer has to be turned on as well as the computer that you've set this up on. Um, your, your computer cannot go into a hibernation mode or into a sleep mode and the hard drive cannot turn off. So you want to make sure all of that is, is, is set to continue to run while you're away. Um, if you have any questions about this or anything else we have at Condi, please give me a call to 1-800-826-6332, option 2 for the first available tech, or you can send us an email to support at Thank you.